because I found this conversation funny. So. Okay. I, I think it's optional, but still. Okay, but still, yes. If it's wrong, why are you so quiet? Why did I read that as why are you so stupid? The autofill in my brain was just like, stupid? Is she going to say stupid? <laughs> Or no, I think I read it in my mind as, why are you stupid? Because I saw the S and my mind auto-filled and then I was like, oh, it didn't say stupid. My, uh, she was supposed to be in here training. Yet it appears she's nowhere to be seen. What's that? That strange lock? It wasn't there two days ago. This whole room is giving us some really strange vibes. Okay. It's an antique dresser. Don't you dare open it, Phoenix Fright! Now I know how Maya feels when they tell her not to touch <laughs> I don't know why, I just found that very, uh, relevant to, especially our playthrough, with the whole green envelope thing. Yes. <laughs> what a pity. It's full of nothing but old clothes for the, the acolytes. So we weren't opening it! I'm from the prosecutor's office. I can do anything. Okay, if you can do anything, <laughs> Wait. Uh, fly over that bridge. That's exactly what I thought when I first, uh, was, okay, can you fly over the bridge? Was that you? <laughs> yeah, if you can fly over that bridge, why didn't you do it earlier? <laughs> well, that means that whoever did fly over the bridge was a prosecutor. <laughs> it was Edgeworth. Edgeworth is the murderer! Anyways. You imagine. <laughs> why, why can't I hear some bad turn out? But you're just like. Probably one of the most polite murderers ever. Excuse me. Um. <laughs> Like, excuse me, I'm about to murder you right now. Do you mind? Excuse me. Hello. Yeah? Um, I apologize for what is about to happen in advance. However... Why? I... need to update the autopsy report. It appears the name on it is incorrect. Uh, no... What do you mean by that? How do you spell your name again? Why do you want to know that? Because, unfortunately, it appears you're going to be my next victim. Uh, it's spelled with letters. Well, I'll let the detective figure that one out. Anyways, I'm sorry for what I have to do next. But please die. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Yeah, you can do anything except stand out to a nine-year-old girl. <sighs> okay. This door. The door. Um, when I was here two days ago, that weird lock wasn't on it. So strange. It's almost as if they're guarding something inside that cavern. I've never seen a lock quite like this before. Why does it look familiar? I have... I've seen locks and chains like this before. Yeah, it looks like those fake locks. Exactly. Yeah. They look like the one that guards a person's secret during the psych walk. 
during. I thought I thought they were called. No, what? Never. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not gonna question the grammatical semantics of this. Um. Oh, can I? Yes, so, please. What? Wait, what? I don't. Maybe what? Uh, I was thinking. It might be weird to switch characters, like, in the middle of this, but, um, do you want to voice Iris in this? I kind of like the voice you do for her. Okay. <laughs> it's always fun to animate those conversations. Anyways. Yes. Okay. Should I keep reading? Yes. Dark secrets in a dark cavern. I am being von Karma in this investigation. Yes. She is much more interesting than Mr. Phoenix Wright. What do you think this yellowish poster is, Phoenix Wright? <clears throat> Just scroll. Not a poster. It's a picture, um... Why does it matter? Next, you'll be telling me since that ladder outside is a must be called a step ladder. Can we not start this right now? No, it's not the time. Not the it's the time to start. What? I was simply making an example. You act like you've had an. An intense argument about that topic before. Yes, it's funny you bring that up. I thought you said you didn't want to talk about it. And I don't want to talk to no. you, so just continue. Want to talk about it? I'm saying it's funny you brought that up. It's a scroll. Wait, we are. You did. Okay. You did not finish your line. Mr. It's Phoenix a picture of a, Why would up if you didn't interrupt me? I wouldn't have interrupted you if you had not corrected me. Okay. It, it's a picture of a woman who's actually... Did it take... it couldn't have... Is that... Okay, here's the thing, is... A woman? My brain's going between two things. Either that nacho cheese sauce or yellow paint. It's gravy. Or gravy. A woman? I don't see any woman here. Atmosphere in this room since I last was here. No, it's not a different atmosphere, it's a different smell. It's gravy! See? I told you. I've played this game before. Which is the only reason why I knew that that was gravy. What's the matter? This scroll has been completely covered in gravy. Why? I don't know. <laughs> either, either someone was eating in here and they're extremely clumsy, hmm. or they are hungry and uh, decided to yes. eat the scroll. There is a very appetizing it. smell in the air. But gravy is a type of sauce. So when you run out of paint, you Americans use gravy as a substitute, I see. <laughs> no! Also, this is what you call art? This looks like what was in my toilet after I had that Taco Bell for the first time. Oh, yes, that does take the while to get the used to. Uh, 
And you Americans call this art? I mean, it could be. Mr. Phoenix Wright, should I have sold my toilet, perhaps? I mean, someone would probably be willing to pay money for it. Why? Why? Uh, I have no idea. Apparently, I heard somewhere that apparently, I think like someone said, like a blank canvas sold like for a uh, like millions of dollars because that was the entire piece. It was a blank canvas. I would say I would like to go back to Germany, but unfortunately we have people like that there, too. Oh, really? There is no escape from stupid people. Uh, you don't know the- you, you don't know most of it. There are people who think the Earth is flat. It's not? Wait, what? That was a joke, Phoenix, right? Laugh or I will whip you. I was going to say, you of all people, I would not think would believe that. Laugh or I will whip you. Uh, 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 I guess uh, I will accept that. Laughs of fear are still laughs in my book. Okay. No, no one does that. For starters, it stinks. I, for one, find the smell of gravy very appetizing. I mean, after it sits there for a long time and it starts rotting. But yes, at that point... But at the moment, it's actually making me very hungry. Don't eat scroll, please. Why would I eat the scroll? You said you were hungry. So that means I will eat the scroll? Because he's. Like, you said you like the smell of gravy and you were hungry. The skull has gravy on it. That doesn't mean I'm going to eat the scroll. Oh, that is I'm, I'm sorry. I'm just so used to having to tell Maya that. Maya eats ancient scrolls because they have gravy on them? I'm no, pretty sure eats, that is considered eats, paper. She just eats thick because they their food, and then I had to tell her not to, because A scroll is not food, or... Phoenix Wright. Gravy's food? Yes, but if she's eating a scroll, that would be considered pika. No, no, she doesn't eat scrolls on a daily basis. She just eats then food. what are you talking about? I have no idea! You make absolutely no sense to me, Phoenix Wright. Do you not think I already know that? I do already know that. <sighs> I only make sense to myself sometimes. Well, well, okay then. You also forgot to that it is a waste of gravy to do this. Yes. Thank you, Von Karma. You are very and welcome. This must be the gravy that we had with the roast on the night of the incident. But why would anyone do this? Why this scroll?
What took you so long? I thought even you'd manage to get here faster than this, Mr. Trite. Prosecutor, God, oh, I didn't know you were here. Wait, you're a murderer? Wait, what? Uh... What did you just ask me? My sister was telling me earlier that there might be a murderer here. You're here. I don't know how you got here, so thus you must be the murderer! That is extremely flawed logic. <laughs> I'm sorry. I am stressed, and I am tired, and I don't know where Maya is. I heard that nine-year-old girl also got trapped over here. Yes. She was here, and so and did she Maya. ran away. So by that logic, either of them could also be the murderer. Seriously, what is your logic? My logic is that I'm stressed out and I don't know where Maya is. He was just trying to tell me that Americans sell poop as art. <laughs> no, what? I'm not saying that we Where? do that on a regular basis. I'm just saying that if you did, there's a chance that someone would buy it. Only Americans, though, Trite? I mean, I'm sure there are some insane people in this world that are not Americans. Yes! I'm not saying that it's just this country. Saying that there's probably someone out there that would purchase this. Then he tried to tell me that his partner constantly eats sc sc scrolls that have gravy on them. No, I'm trying to tell you that she eats pretty much any food that she can see. It's a right. problem and I have to tell her not to. How little do you pay your assistant that she has to eat scrolls? <laughs> he also tried to go through those drawers over there. What? Trite, those drawers are only for prosecutors to open. We're allowed to do anything we want. You're a defense attorney. Is there something you would like to say to me? Trite? Uh... I have a question, actually. Okay. Where's your coffee? That's a good question. Where is my coffee? Could somebody get me a cup of coffee. There is no coffee maker, and if even if there was, there's no place to plug it in. Trite. What? I'm currently panicking. Go get me coffee. Uh, there is no coffee here? Get There's me no coffee? coffee maker. I am panicking. I need coffee. Like I said, there isn't any coffee here. Why not? Because there's no coffee maker. And the nearest Starbucks slash Dunkin' Donuts or a place that serves coffee is like a thousand miles away. I'm being- I'm going to go on a quick jog. I will be back shortly. You're gonna jog a thousand miles for coffee? 
for coffee. I will go to the ends of the earth. We should probably get help with that. That sounds like a problem. Oh, wait. Now I remember. I put my coffee right over there. Okay. It's probably cold. Unless you keep it in a thermos. Or some what? sort of insulative container. Oh, no. I can just use the lasers on my face to heat it up. Of course. How could I forget about that? That was a joke. Now laugh or I will hit you with my laser beams. I thought you said you didn't have them. Exactly. That was also a joke. I will attack you with my coffee cup. Uh, the coffee is frozen solid. Uh, 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 so it might be a little different. What? What was your question again? I don't drink coffee. No, well, you had a question other than that, I thought. I don't remember. Why he wasn't at the trial. Uh huh? He asked why Gata wasn't at the trial. Trial. Ew. <clears throat> Um, that's a long story. No, no, Phoenix asked Gatto why Gatto was not at the trial. Yes. Yes. Why wasn't he? I don't know. Ask him. Oh, why weren't you at the trial? Nick, I can't ask him. I'm just a hallucination. Sorry! I was so used to you being here! What? How often uh, do I see you outside of court? Uh, I was talking to Maya! Wait, where is I mean, Maya? Uh, anyways, your question again? Why weren't you at the trial? Huh. I could ask the exact same question to you. Uh, but he was. He had a cold, so. You had a cold? I had something slightly more important than a common cold to deal with. The importance of which is something you have no hope of ever understanding. Enough! I believe I have some measure of you. You are the very worst kind of prosecutor. What could be more important than a trial? Who's the wild mare, Trite? Uh, this is Miss Van Karma. She's yeah, she was the acting prosecutor in your absence today. Huh. Well, I guess I owe you one then. But you can go now, princess. It's time for the big boys to take the reins. Wow. Just who do you think you are? This case is mine. Hey, Philly. Know your role and shut your mouth. I can't stand women like you. I'm only going to say this once, Lady Von Wippenberg. Go home. He upsets Tumble or just like Mr. Armando too? Wait, what? <laughs> there is an episode where Mr. Armando is upsetting Tumbler. Yeah, Tumbler's gonna have a field day with this one. Phoenix Bright! What are you hitting me for? Huh. You deserve even more cracks of the whip than that trite. We're going to end it here. Thanks for watching, Pharaoh. Pharaoh.